LAPD says a man is wearing a badge, but he is not an officer. In fact, they say he's a thief. They're looking for this phony cop, and KCALIDE's Cara Finstrom shows us they have just released videos they tried to track him down. Detectives are zeroing in here on the 800 block of Broadway in Chinatown. Within 24 hours, security cameras captured what appears to be three separate incidents of jewelry thieves at work. A camera was rolling at 11.30 a.m. when this duo went after a $10,000 dragon necklace. While he's looking at the chain, the second suspect distracts the jewelry owner by asking to see another piece of jewelry. The jewelry owner goes to show him that piece of jewelry. First suspect runs out the store. Um, second suspect pauses and he runs out as well. Minutes later, an LAPD officer stopped and arrested 19 year old Gerald Roberts of LA, who's now charged with grand theft. The other suspect and the dragon necklace are still missing. Four hours later, at the same store, detectives say this even more troubling attempted heist took place. A gentleman comes into the store and identifies himself as a Los Angeles Police Department detective uh, wearing a Dodger shirt and a what we believe to be as a fake badge and set of handcuffs. That man asked to see a chain similar to the one stolen earlier in the day. The store's owner then asked for a business card and the suspect gave him this bogus one before leaving. The third incident took place at another jewelry store yesterday. This video shows two men stepping out of an orange Mustang with paper plates. One was armed with what appears to be a semi-automatic rifle and the other a hammer. Police say the owners quickly locked the door and the men left. They say the Mustang collided with another car as it pulled away but kept going. This area is not safety, yeah. Detectives say they want shoppers and business owners to know they're now working to find all the suspects caught on cameras. From Chinatown, Cara Finstrom, KCAL 9 News.